But um, yeah, there's no support as far as the OTG cable with any cell phone using the Android system. <laughs> Island Tech, how's it going this evening? Here on Island Tech, I talk about technology, use technology, and share my experience with it. Today, I just wanted to do a quick video about the DJI Spark and the updates as far as 10.2.2. Uh, I've gotten great feedback as far as a review I made uh, several months back. You guys have been giving me great support as well as things to look at and sharing with each other. I love the community, how the DJI Spark community is coming together. Here, uh, this is a follow-up to that. Uh, essentially, I have the Android system and I tested that out again based on the new updates and lo and behold, unfortunately, no, it does not work. So I think DJI has completely dissevered. I think they're moving towards an Apple system. I'm not Apple biased or anything. I've just been using, I, I guess you could say I'm Android biased. But um, yeah, there's no support as far as the OTG cable with any cell phone using the Android system. It won't show any satellites that are connected. It won't show your battery life. It won't show the battery meter as far as how much percentage of battery you have left. And three, you'll, you'll notice a red, um, something red as far as your distance or height. Uh, regardless if you're indoors or outdoors, that should at least say some type of elevation or whatnot. If you have the DJI Spark, uh, it will not show telemetry when using the OTG cable. I'm a little bit disappointed, but at the same time, uh, DJI has made updates as far as you know, trying to stabilize the picture quality and um, you know streaming, trying to reduce the delay and especially drop-offs. I remember when we first got this back in October, there were several drop-offs. They've made great improvements as far as fixing that problem. So let me know how you guys feel about that. Uh, if you guys do have an Android system, have you guys switched over to an Apple? Are you guys just flying purely Wi-Fi? Are you guys still trying the OTG cable? Um, leave a comment below. I'd love to know what you guys are doing. Are you guys even are you guys selling your spark for the new Mavic Air? Is it worth it for you guys? I'd love to know what you guys how you guys feel about that. As for me, I'm just gonna continue to use my DJI Spark. Uh, I'm not upgrading to the Mavic Air anytime soon, mainly because I love the Spark just for its purposes, which means uh, for YouTube itself, 1080 is just fine for me. If you guys like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you guys are new to the channel, again, welcome. Hopefully you guys enjoyed what you heard. Please consider subscribing for any future episodes dealing with technology, talking about technology, using it, and sharing it with you. Just keep the support coming. I love interacting with everyone, seeing how everybody's helping each other out, especially with the DJI Spark. Thank you guys for tuning in, and see you guys next time. Mahalo plenty.